you want to flip properties and make massive lump sums of cash, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it in this video. The ultimate checklist, not only on what you need to look for, but also I'm going to show you these numbers and the exact deal calculator that I used to do over 16 million pounds worth of deals in the first three years of me investing. When you are looking at a flip, yeah, you need to be looking on how you can change the bracket. What's the brackets? The brackets are the number of bedrooms. That's the first thing. So what are people looking for when they're buying a flip for a family home? It's going to be the location. What's around the location? It's going to be the garden. It's going to be the uh, bathrooms and it's going to be the kitchen. Yeah, these are all and the number of bedrooms. So these are the first things you want to look to put them in another bracket. So. The major question you want to be asking yourself when you're doing a flip is if I had that amount of money to purchase on a house, would I buy this house that I'm about to create? So in this particular one, I'm going to explain this calculator to you in a bit of a um, thing. But check this out, yeah. We've got this uh, headline price as 475000 So if I'm going to spend 475000 on a house, would I buy this house? That's what I've got to ask myself. Yeah. So the next thing is when I'm buying either a piece of land or a, a house, I need to say, right, so two bedroom, I need to make it three bedroom. It's a three bedroom, I need to make it four bedroom. That's going to be putting it into a different category. You're going to be creating a massive leverage and a massive change in the value. And that is how you want to create the gap. If you want to know what the gap advantage is when it comes to finding great property investment deals check this video out here it's on my youtube channel make sure you subscribe by the way because i'm going to be hitting out these videos for you to succeed in property left right and center so let's check this out this particular one was actually on the side of a flip that i did that i purchased a flip for two hundred and fifty thousand. we spent about forty thousand on it and we sold it for about 315 yeah so we made some nice wedge on that yeah but really and the reason we bought that is because this was the deal we wanted to do so then the, the the land portion was 115 so that was the purchase price there yeah so 115,000 yeah and the cost to build the house on the land was 120,000 yeah now what's going to happen is we know we want to refinance or we actually want to sell it for this and if we sell it at this we're going to make 200,000 pound profit that's what's going to happen but very important what people don't realize especially in this market right now if i don't sell it i better make sure that it works on the back end so check this baby out how it works on the back end now if I cannot sell it and make that £200,000 profit, then what I need to do is I need to make sure, so the cash flow right here, after refinance, you can see it's £66. Now, we've stress tested it here uh, on a higher percentage of mortgage, but also, if I refinance it at £475,000, which I know I can, do you know why? Because on this particular deal, I did. Yeah, but we do our research, we teach people how to do the research on this to make sure that that works. You can see here, this is like money left in or out. This is £102,000 actually coming out of the deal. So if I did have to refinance it, if I actually wanted to make some cash flow, what I can do there is uh, I don't have to take the, the, the full amount of the 475000 and take 75% loan to value, what I can do is I can take a lesser loan to value because I've got a hundred thousand pounds of extra cash I can pull out. Now, if I want the cash, because I want to put go and put a hundred thousand pounds into another deal, but I know it's still gonna what we call wash its face, which is it's gonna make 66 pounds, even stress tested worst case scenario here then uh, I know that if I don't sell this potential uh, flip, then I can keep it for a bit longer and I can sell it later down the line. I mean, I could also choose to do it because you know what's also built in here is a 23,000 pound buffer that uh, if I want to sell it quick as a flip, because that's what it's about, turning things around quick, then I'm going to be given 23 discount off that 475. You know, so I've already built in a little bit of buffer as well, because I, so potentially if I sell it on target, I could be making 223,000 pounds. Now, who wouldn't mind making 223,000 pounds? Put that in the comments. Yeah. 223,000 in 2023, oh, that's cool, that's a sign. Yeah, but the ultimate thing is here, I've got options and that's what you wanna have. When it comes to doing a flip deal or a rental deal, or a HMO deal, or a property deal, or hotels and resorts deal, you're gonna need options. So you've got plenty of options here. You've got options on refinancing. You've got options on increasing the cash flow if you want. You've got options on taking 100K out if you refinance it. If you sell it, you've got options that you're going to make 200,000 pounds. You know, this is this is where you want to be. You want to have options. So when you're going in to a uh, deal, 
all of these things I just talked about, that's what you want to be looking for. How can I add an extra bedroom? How can I put some, you know, make the kitchen better? How can I, you know, extend out and have, you know, more luxury? How can I make sure the garden's good? And I've got to buy the location where, I don't mean this in like a morbid way, but like where people have to die for properties to become available. You know, the amount of money I've made on flips in areas like that, little nook and cranny villages that are tucked away. You know, people always talk like, where's the best place to invest? Liverpool, Derby, Leeds, you know, Peterborough, all of this stuff. Yeah, good, excellent, rental yields and all that, I get it. But the little places that are tucked away, so there's a place right near you. I know, wherever you is, you're watching this, I know there's a place right near you where there'll be a, like a little village or something like that where when houses become available you better jump on them you better start adding value to them yeah because there's a massive opportunity right now in the next couple of years to make this happen and if you don't take advantage of it oh my god the storm that's coming you're going to find it hard to weather it so until next time you make sure you subscribe to this video go watch the other videos on here to help you get started in your property journey and until next time do the right thing for the right reason because it's the only way you're going to discover your true potential